Hello YouTube, it's your host P. Sherman Wolby Tank Gaming, and today's video more information for Battlefield One. Well, uh, I know I have this, I use the same thing every time when I always do my introductions, but uh, just recently, uh, Dice has been throwing tons of information to everyone for the Battlefield One community, and, and now uh, they just released on their website. If you go check out on their website, uh, the, there's four new maps they have um, shown for like all the ten maps. All, uh, let's just get into the uh, four brand new maps that will be in the uh, final game. I don't know if they'll show any gameplay or just like anything right now, like any gameplay, but here is the four new maps that are coming out. The first map is called Argon Forest. It is a, um, a forest located in France, and it was, it was like one of the last battles the Americans took part in. So expect to see American soldiers and German soldiers fighting them out in the forest. And the, it's going to be like a lot of infantry combat with like melee weapons and brutal bayonet charges, flamethrowers, you get it, gas grenades and everything in that forest. And who can win that battle? It depends on the Americans or it's in the hands of the Germans. Then moving along is the Ballroom Blitz. It's an another American map located in France and it's basically just an another ally defensive uh, that has the Americans involved in it. Don't worry, the French will come in. I hope the uh, French will come in soon, like, and they'll be put into all these maps, and that'll be really cool if they're in. But Blitz, Ballroom Blitz is basically, that's its name, is basically just like the French are uh, attacking these objectives. Like, the Americans, sorry, sorry. The Americans are uh, just like attacking this uh, town, and like it's Metz, the town of, of the city of Metz. And there's going to be a lot of infantry close core combat, a lot of tanks involved, and it's going to be more urban environments if you get it, if you know what I mean. Then we go to a desert map, which is called uh, Foul Fortress, which is, uh, Foul Fortress is a map taking place in, uh, like in the, in the desert area. So basically, it's near the coast of like, I don't know, somewhere in the, somewhere in like uh, Turkey or somewhere like along that line. But expect this at map to be more to the coast, and it'll be the dreaded, not the battleship will be probably be in the map. And the uh, description from the video uh, from the uh, website they said is the British are are trying to invade this uh, oil fields nearby located near this map, and so the Turkish uh, defenders are not giving up no matter the cost, and so it's going to be basically the British just are trying to throw everything they got to get this oil fields because the dreadnought needs to feed which basically means they, they need some oil for their ships and all that stuff so that's what it means so it's another desert map and then the final map that is confirmed is the map called uh, Suez it's the map Suez is basically taking place in the Suez Canal area and for some reason the Ottoman Empire manages to uh, take hold manages to cross the, uh, the Sinai uh, River and gets it to the British, uh, like friendly, like British lines, and they're now sabotaging everything. So it's going to be another uh, uh, desert map, but this is going to be really interesting for the operations game mode. So expect the operation game mode to have uh, the desert map and the open beta from the Sinai Desert and the uh, uh, Foul Fortress and Suez connected to this map. Um, we'll have to wait for the other maps. To come out to work with operations, but for now, uh, this is all the new information released. Um, there's also some new information from Dice is that they're gonna nerf the light tank. Yay! So I'm super happy about that. They're finally nerfing the light tank because that was really too powerful in my opinion. Then moving along, we got they're gonna give the support a um, like some like info like some like anti-tank weapons. <laughs> you know, if you see my all gadgets uh, video, I had I really wanted DICE to hopefully implement it, uh, some like uh, anti-tank weapons for support. So, and also the community has been um, getting some information, uh, giving the feedback to DICE to tell them to bring them some more information to it. I like give them some anti-tank weapons that includes the, uh, both, uh, both the, uh, what was it called? <laughs> both uh, medic and support classes. So you expect both of them to get the uh, both anti-tank weapons and the description for the support class and, and this anti uh, anti vehicle weapon it's like a it's like going to be like some grenade or something like that i believe um then uh they're gonna like fix rush 
Um, they're gonna like basically just like I think they didn't give them too much de dive into much detail, but what they said was they uh the, the uh de like they're gonna like probably like fix something because the open beta version of Rush was really unbalanced because there is way too many tanks. Like seriously, if you played Rush on the on the open beta, there is way too many tanks, and it's like a constant spam of tanks and. It wasn't fun for both team, like both the offensive team, if they lost all their tanks, and then the defenders have like all their tanks. So I'm I'm glad they're probably gonna increase. I hope, and uh, they probably decrease the tanks or something like that. What I'm hoping Dice would do is like probably just bring in more people to this game mode because 24 v uh, like a 12 v 12 game is not really fun for for a rush game. So I'm hoping they uh, just like increase the player amount, get rid of tanks. Even though I love tanks, uh, it's just this game mode, the, the tanks just are too powerful, in my opinion. Um, anything else? The, uh, let's see. The, uh, that's basically all the brand new information that is provided from DICE. So, expect ton, uh, lots of other videos that are going to come out from other bigger YouTubers to cover tons of new Battlefield 1 gameplay and information coming out. So, there's tons of new information to check out. Uh, go check out the Battlefield 1 website page. Like, go check out their website. Uh, they'll be, it'll go into more detail about the new four maps that are revealed and the operations game mode and all the other game modes. So that's all I have to say. Uh, I hope you guys did enjoy today's video. Uh, <laughs> I'm sorry I did, I'm sorry I usually don't post usually during the school week, but today is tons of new information coming out. So I just wanted to get another video out for you guys to enjoy. Uh, so that's anyway. Remember guys to uh, like, share, and subscribe. So, uh, show it to anyone that is really interested to see more Battlefield 1 content, be it 4 content, and Call of Duty Zombies gameplay. And that's all to say. I hope you guys have an awesome week. Have an awesome day. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Uh, and bye.